Dear Lord. Thank you. Father, in the name of Jesus, we agree with this prayer, and we continue to pray for America. Father, we lift up this nation before you whom you've created for your end time purpose to preach this gospel in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you, Lord, that you've raised us up in America, Lord, to expand your kingdom, Father, here in the mighty name of Jesus. And, Father, we release your word, 2 Thessalonians 2, 7. It is written, for the mystery of lawlessness, is already at work only he who now restrains will do so until he is taken out of the way in the mighty name of the father we release your word now into america that your holy spirit will restrain further lawlessness righteousness and looting in the name of jesus in the cities of america father in the mighty we release your word to enter into the united states government in jesus name we decree and declare there will be restraint of deception there will be restraint of lies there will be restraint of military coups in jesus name against the president of the united states we release your word into the congress and into the senate in the name of jesus we restrain any further laws in the name of jesus that will be voted in the Senate in the name of Jesus to try to disrupt your agenda for America and the, uh, a purpose that you've given Donald Trump to return this nation back to you. In the mighty yes. name of Jesus, we issue a heavenly restraint from yes. the courts of heaven in the name of Jesus against all policies, plans, Schemes, the vices of the enemy, the deep state, and the new water operatives in the United States government in the name of Jesus. They are bound, canceled, foiled, spoiled, and of no effect against the people of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we give you praise. We release your word, Daniel 2.44. It is written, and in the days of these kings shall the God of heaven set up a kingdom which shall never be destroyed, and the kingdom shall not be left to other people, but it shall break in pieces and consume all these kingdoms, and it shall stand forever. Father, in the name of Jesus, we are now in your kingdom on this earth, Father, and we release your kingdom to consume every kingdom of the enemy. We consume abortion. We consume anarchy. We consume deception. We consume edification lies. We consume edible shot rebellion in the name of Jesus against you, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. And we consume it in the name of Jesus. We decree and declare the kingdom of God increases now in America, in the name of Jesus, in in the government, in the government, we speak to the governors of the United States in the name of Jesus. We take authority over you now. Every rogue governor in the name of Jesus that does not favor the righteous cause of God Almighty. El Shaddai is his name, God Almighty. We put you into subjection to the will and the purpose of Almighty God. You will, Kerebesha, do his pleasure. You will, Kerebesha, do his purpose in the name of Jesus. Regarding the 50 states in the mighty name of Jesus, we overturn and cancel every governmental law policy, that has been enacted, written, concocted in the name of Jesus or devised against the agenda of the kingdom of heaven in all 50 states to be canceled, spoiled and spoiled in Jesus' name. Father, your word declares that you hold the heart of the kings in your hand and as the rivers of water, you turn it whichever way you please. We release your word now over the governors of the uh, United States of America, Father, that they will now turn and do your will. We release your thoughts to enter into their hearts and enter into their minds to do your will and to execute righteousness and justice in Jesus' mighty name. We give you praise. We give you glory. We thank you. We honor you, Father. Oh, we give you praise, Father. Father, we release the kingdom of God to enter into the seven spheres, Father, in the name of Jesus, that they will, your, your kingdom, Father, will enter into the church, 
Father, that you will rebuke and cancel this uh, uh, false church religious system, Father, that moves by the traditions of men and not by your word. In the mighty name of Jesus, we tear down every tradition of man in Jesus' name. Every man-made word works in Jesus' name that goes Amen. against the knowledge of God. We tear it down and cause it to become no effect in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we release your kingdom to expand in all denominations, Father, in the name of Jesus, and that the wind of your Holy Spirit will blow through every denomination, Father, in Jesus' name, correcting every wrong in Jesus' name. We ask for your Holy Spirit to speak unto the pastors, the shepherds of your people that are not hearing you, Father. We ask for your Holy Spirit to speak Speak unto them what thus saith the Lord God Almighty, and that they will hear. We pray, Father, give your shepherds of your people hearing ears and seeing eyes to hear what the Spirit is saying to the churches. Father, we in Jesus' mighty name, we ask you to remove every demonic influence, distraction, seduction, lie, and deception that the leaders of the body of Christ in America have been seduced into believing and hearing father in jesus name we silence the voice of the enemy and we shut the mouth of deception we shut the mouth of edification lies and deceit in jesus Christ's name coming into the ears of the leaders of the body of christ and we say father release your holy spirit cause them to hear your words father let it burn deeply in their heart and Get the account out of us to order the house in order in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you, Lord, as you have declared unto your prophets that this word will get to your people and that we will hear and obey, that we will come into alignment with your purposes for Donald Trump and the kingdom of heaven in America in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray. Father, we come against false prophets false prophets in yeah. Jesus' name, yeah. speaking yeah. deceit yeah. to your people in the name of Jesus. We shut yeah. their mouth in Jesus' yeah. mighty name, yeah. and we cause their words to fall yeah. to the ground. We ask you to raise yeah. up the true prophets that speak yeah. by your Holy Spirit, Father, the truth unto yeah. your people, so that we will know your mind, we will know your heart, we will know your agenda, we will know your plans, <laughs> and that we will get in alignment. We will speak your words and do your deeds in the name of Jesus, that you might be glorified. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise and glory and honor. We thank you right now, Father, for turning America around. In the name of Jesus, we release the blood of Jesus over the city, over the streets. In the name of Jesus, over the homes, we plead the power of the blood. In the mighty name of Jesus. And Father, we thank you for uncovering every plot and plan. In the name of Jesus, and scheme of the enemy to destroy America. America. We call it null and void in Jesus' name. It shall not take effect in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we give you praise. We release Psalm 33, Father 10. The, the Lord bringeth the counsel of the heathen to nothing. He maketh the devices of the people of none effect. The counsel of the Lord shall stand forever, the force of his heart to all generations. Father, we pray for the 40-member pastoral council upon President Trump in Jesus' name. Father, that you raise up the prophets, Father, the true prophets, to speak unto him your counsel. Father, every man or woman, Father, that is on that council that is not there for the right reasons, that is not interceding on behalf of Donald Trump to hear what you are saying to him. Father, we pray in Jesus' name, let no confusion, no lies, no deception or alternate agenda, alternate agenda that is not of the kingdom of heaven. Get to Donald Trump. We cancel every demonic word, distraction, lie, deception that will try to come to him. Father, we pray, Father, raise up your prophets to speak unto him, Father. Give him your divine counsel. We decree and declare your counsel shall stand in Donald Trump's life. He shall hear your words. He shall understand and he shall do. In the name of Jesus, we thank you for giving him strategy, 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 Father. In the name of Jesus. And we decree and declare Donald Trump shall have good success, uncommon wisdom, discernment, 
and insight into the things of the kingdom and how to govern this nation righteously in the mighty name of Jesus. We give you praise and glory. We honor you. We thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. We release, Father, the kingdom of God to enter into our families. Father, we pray, Lord, that you reconcile our families. We pray for heavenly marriages, heavenly marriages. Father, restore the marriages of the American family, Father. We pray for heaven on earth in their marriages. Return the fathers unto their children, Father. We pray for peace, restitution of all things and family relationships in the American family in Jesus' name. We rebuke and curse divorce in Jesus' name. We release heavenly love, godly love, a godly love between husbands and wives. We release understanding, peace, and unity in the name of Jesus. We come against every demonic force coming against the American family to pull it apart. And we bind the works of the enemy. We bind divorce, father, argument, selfishness, distraction, lust, seduction, and selfishness, idle minded. We bind it and cast it out of the American marriages. In Jesus' name, we release your peace. We release your order, Father, to yes, come forth in the American family in Jesus' mighty name. Father, Jesus we name. release the kingdom of God to enter and take over education. Father, we thank you, Lord, that you will remove every evolutionary teaching in Jesus' name. That creation will be taught and the truth of your word will dominate the educational world in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you for bold professors full of the Holy Ghost, Father. They're now yes, yes. into university chairs and, and, and authority. And, and yes, Father, yes. and all of the professors, Lord, and all of the staff, Father, you will send from your kingdom in the name of Jesus that will turn, Father, and shift the education, Father, in the name of the American people, Lord, to righteousness, to truth, and to justice according to your word, your precepts, and your concepts in Jesus' mighty name. We thank you, Lord, for unwriting, edible, every edible shakara, bosata, university law and policy that prevents Christians from speaking the truth in Jesus' name. We pray, Father, for every class in Jesus' name that has not been ordained, Father, by your kingdom to be, yes, Father, withdrawn overthrown and edited, taken out of the universities of America. Father, we pray, Father, your your education, your knowledge will be taught, Father, for all of them will be taught of the Lord, Father. In Jesus' name, Father, we decree and declare the, the glory, the knowledge of the glory of the Lord shall fill the earth and shall fill the university campuses, Father, in the books, Father, in the videos, Father, in virtual classrooms, Father, the truth of your word, the knowledge of your glory shall now enter dominating America, society, in Jesus' mighty name. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor. We thank you right now. We release the kingdom of God. Father, to take over. And enter into the government, Father. We command and we release it. Governmental authority in the United States yes. now come under the kingdom of God. We thank you, Lord, now, the Supreme Court in Jesus' name, the Congress, the Senate, and the State Assembly in Jesus' name. Come into alignment with the word of God. We take authority over every bill in the name of Jesus that exalts itself against the knowledge of God that Jesus is Lord. We take authority and we tear up those bills in Jesus' name. We tear up every more anything. Yeah, support for abortion. Yeah, we yeah, decree and declare abortion yeah. is illegal in the United yeah. States of America yeah. and all yeah. its yeah. territories. In Jesus mighty name, we take authority over every congressman, over every senate, and assemblyman and assemblywoman to do the work of the Lord. We decree and declare, you shall, Rebbe Sheh, decree and declare righteous laws that honor the Lord God Almighty, and He is the Lord God, the Lord of hosts is His name. We speak now governmental alignment in America, in the government, in the state, the federal and local government in Jesus' mighty name. We give you praise and glory and honor. Father, we thank you in Jesus' mighty name. 
and we release the kingdom, Father, in the name of Jesus, over the media. We take authority over the media. We decree and declare the kingdom of heaven now increases and takes over the media in Jesus' mighty name. We cancel out every lie, every spirit of seduction and fear in the name of Jesus coming through the media. We take authority over and bind those spirits. They are bound and under arrest. It is now known and void in the media in Jesus' mighty name. We take authority over the airways. We release the hosts of heaven now to thrive. Principalities ruling the media. The newspapers, the magazines in Jesus' name. You YouTube, Facebook, social media platforms in Jesus' name. We take authority now in Jesus' name and say we take you captive in the name of Jesus. You will now declare the truth of God's word. You will declare integrity. You will not forbid conservative Christian voices from blanketing the airways in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we take authority over all the presidents and owners of these platforms in Jesus' name. We strip them of their influence, their demonic influence in Jesus' name. And they will do the word of the Lord. They will do the work of the Lord in Jesus' mighty name. We lose liberty now. We declare the gospel has free liberty over the social media platform and over every major media network. We release the spirit of the Lord to enter. But where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Therefore, we release the Holy Ghost. Enter into the media, Father, in Jesus' name. Into all social media platforms. And we say the gospel now has free court. Free court. There will be no limitations. There will be no silencing of your voice, Father. Your truth, Father. Through the prophetic voices you put on the media and in the social platforms. In Jesus' mighty name. And we declare seven times more favor with the nation seven times more access to the nation and the general population of the earth in jesus name to all the kingdom of heaven the prophetic voices now in the name of jesus we share this in the blood of jesus we release the kingdom of god to enter and take over the art and business we release the kingdom of God now. We take authority over entertainment. We take authority yeah. over the art and the most And we release the kingdom of God to dominate yeah. now. We release new artists, Father, in Jesus' name. From your kingdom to dominate the airways, to dominate the music, to dominate to dominate the artists in Jesus' name. The kingdom of heaven comes alive. The kingdom of heaven dominates now and consumes all demonic kingdoms. And Father, finally, we release the kingdom to enter into commerce or business. Father, we ask you, raise up, Father, your people, Lord, with business strategies. New invention yeah. now coming from the yeah. kingdom of heaven. Father, may it be imparted into your people. Young entrepreneurs, geniuses, brilliant, filled with the power yeah. of the Holy Spirit, Father, will yeah. come now with heavenly solutions, kingdom solutions, Father, to the earth's problems, Father, and that they will glorify you. We thank you for the billions, Father, coming into the kingdom to spread yeah. your gospel in the name of oh, Jesus. Yeah. And that the world will come, Father, to the church to hear and to receive instructions and to receive yeah. substance and nutrition and answers for problems, Father. Let it be from your Christians. Let it be from your people, your sons and daughters, Father, who are ready to come and emerge and take the kingdom to the nations. We thank you for raising them up now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, finally we pray for Israel, Israel. Father, as they get ready to take land back, they're about to annex Erebosata, the West Bank, which belongs to them in the first place, in Jesus' name. Father, Erebosha, we release Obadiah 117, but upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance, and there shall be holiness and the house of Jacob shall possess their possession. We release Amen. this word yes, over God. Israel now. We declare it is written, you shall possess yes, your possession you possess in the your mighty possession. name of Jesus name Christ. Of Jesus. Father, we thank you, Lord. Yes, Father, we give you glory. We release Leviticus 26, 4 through 6. 
then I will give you rain in due season, and the land shall yield her increase, and the trees of the field shall yield their fruit, and your threshing shall reach unto the vintage, and the vintage shall reach unto the um, uh, sowing time, and ye shall eat your bread to the floor, and dwell in your land peacefully in the mighty name of Jesus. We decree and declare, Father, that Israel annex the land that you've given to Isaac, Isaac, Jacob, and to their children forever. Father, they will recover all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We release the blood of Jesus over Israel and the Israeli defense force, Father. We pray, Father, let your holy delivering mighty angels be upon them, God, as they begin, Father, to take the covenant land that you promised to them, Father, in Jesus' mighty name. We thank you right now. Nasa, we give you glory and honor. And Father, finally, we release Deuteronomy 35 over Israel. And the Lord thy God will bring you into the land which thy fathers possess, and thou shalt possess it. And he will do thee good and multiply thy, multiply you above your fathers. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you right now for new settlements, Lord, being built upon the land of Israel as they annex the West Bank in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we pray, let there be no give back, no compromise, Father, in Jesus' name. When they go forth, Father, in the name of, we pray for the leadership, Benjamin Natiano and Mr. Gale, that they will be in unity, Father, to come forth, Father, and possess the possession and return the West Bank into the the hands of their people in the name of Jesus. Yes, we rebuke Jesus. every Erebesha interfering spirit. We cast down all interfering, hindering, blocking spirits in Jesus' mighty name that will try to hinder them from coming back and taking their land that you have given them in the name of Jesus. We decree and declare good success to Israel in Jesus' yes, name God. and that they shall build, they shall build. Uh, have families, they shall produce children, and they shall rejoice in the Lord their God. We thank you for Benjamin Atiyahu, Father, you are not finished with him. We thank you, Lord, that he shall fulfill his destiny, God, in the name of Jesus. Father, continue to speak to him, Father, in Jesus' name, that he and Minister Gans will do your will in Jesus' name. Neither one of them, Father, will sit, look to the left or to the right, but they will walk Straight on their Amen. divine you, uh, destiny that you have given them, Father, to be a blessing to the nation of Israel in the name of Jesus Christ. We thank you, Father, for your end time plan happening, God. We thank you, Lord, for your blessing and for favor with Israel and America. We thank you, Lord, that the covenant between Israel and America, the bond shall not be broken in Jesus' name. It shall be established. And remain yes, in the name of Jesus, yes, Father. God. We give Hallelujah. you glory and honor oh, and praise. We bless you. We honor you, Father. We thank you, Lord. We bless you, Father. We thank you. Hallelujah. We love you, Lord. We honor you. We thank you for these prayers. We thank you for already moving and doing your will in America yes. and around the world. In the name of Jesus, Father, we bless okay. you and we honor you. In Jesus' name, it is so. Amen and amen. amen.